I'm not gonna say get into this hair because this hair, this right here, is supposed to be fixed. But you wanna know why it's not? Texas. I live in Texas, Houston to be in particular. So we had snow, they had power outages, they had no water, they had no heat. Now I say they because I was in San Antonio at work stuck because i couldn't get back to houston because i drove out there for work a story time on my san antonio trip getting stuck out there because of texas weather is coming soon let me know if y'all want to see it i'm going to record it anyway so when y'all say y'all want to see it it's just going to drop period um also before i get into the full video get into my store i am recently opened i opened this month um it's called jeweled up i sell lashes bonnets hmm, thought i had one right next to me but i don't i have bonnets and i sell mixed drinks if you're in a local houston area we can meet up and i can give you your drinks blah 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 everything is on the website the website will be down below in the description box so check it out even if you don't wear lashes bonnets will do support your girl because she's trying to make it in different areas different places who do it so i haven't recorded in a while and a little bit over two weeks because i couldn't record out there i had no material i had no stand no light no nothing so i was like i just got back yesterday i'm going to record like three videos today but i'm only going to drop them like yo do 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 anyway so in today's video this is going to be my nine month update now, I'm not going to sit up and hold you up and lie. It's not going to be a very long video, but your girl have been drinking. When I say drinking, I mean drinking. Like drinking. Bottles. Bottles. Anyways, because I've been stuck in San Antonio, I've been stuck in the hotel room. Me, I'm not a person that you can sit somewhere and be like okay stay here for three days no it was not a vacation to me it was solitary confinement in prison so what i had to do i, had, I was drinking i had snacks i had no real food because nothing was open so i'm not gonna fully get like undressed undressed but hold on i wanted to make sure when i stand back like y'all can see my whole body y'all you see why i want to get a breast reduction because yeah i have a bra on too so the back You'll be able to see my bra, but oh well. Um, so yeah, these boobs cover up my stomach. Now, I was already a thick girl, and I'm going to keep saying that because some people just think I was already small and I gained weight. No, I was already a thick girl. I only got my stomach, this part of my stomach, then I didn't get lipo 360. They didn't touch my sides, they didn't touch my back. They touched my stomach and then they put it in my butt so i already said i want to go for around two i said two around two and i want to get my back majority done my back because i want this part this this part going right here the little back meat and then my bra rolls but um my stomach i'm okay with and like y'all i wouldn't have wore a shirt like this oh a tron haul because i bought a few cute little outfits also so, I'm going to make that into a whole separate video, even though some of them are the same. Anyways, okay, so, this is how my body looks now in shorts with a crop top or, like, a 
like a little cute bra lip or whatever like i'm not tucking it in if i was tucking it in i'd be like ooh. but so this is how i look from the side with these big boobs this is how Anyway, this is how I look from the back. Other side. From the front. Ew. And yes, I do love how I look. Yes, I am happy because some of y'all haters are trying to come for me. And I'm like, y'all can't bring me down. Like, the only reason y'all talk about somebody is because you hate yourself. Because, baby, I could afford for multiple more rounds if I want to. I'm just not going to do it. So, anyways. <sighs> I'm out of breath. Yeah, I haven't been working out or nothing. I've been literally stuck in San Antonio in a hotel room. like, And it started snowing. I drove back here in the snow yesterday because I was not staying out there no more. I couldn't do it. I'm not staying out there no more. I don't even want to go on another road trip for a long time. Like, keep me in my house. But yeah, so some of the marks, like, here's one from when they cut me. Um, here's one. Here's this one is really like gone. And then they have, I don't know if you can really see it on my back. Cause there's a mark right here where my tattoo is at the bottom there's a mark like there's a mark here and there's a mark here where they cut me or oh then there's two marks right here i'm not going to show that because clearly it's by cooch so um yes i still have like my center side oh i like that you see that don't look at this part. Look at this part. So, I got three here. Two here. Two here. Because, remember, I got local, uh, local anesthesia. And I was awake. I was asleep, but I was awake. They gave me something to help me go to sleep. But it didn't put me to full sleep like general did because remember I woke up two to three times during my surgery I have a story time on that just go through my videos and it's right there um or I may link it below but um what else because this wasn't gonna be a long video I just at least have to make it anyways um yeah everything else been good there's no itching I'm nine months post there's no itching all all my symptoms are gone I wasn't in pain pretty much the whole surgery Nothing, none, none bad, none of that sort. Everything's been good. Um, do when I plan on going back for my second, if I go back for my second round, it's gonna be either the end of this year, beginning of next year. And the only thing I'll be getting is Lipo 360. That's it. If I can get my boobs smaller, here's the thing. I've had big boobs like my whole my whole life, so they're like my comfort zone. Like when I had a bigger stomach, my boobs were always over was like bigger than them, so you couldn't really see when I was eighteen months pregnant. But um, yeah, so I kind I just want them lifted. Y'all see that waist? I just want them lifted, really. Uh, they can make them smaller, but I feel like I'm gonna have to get calm, like used to it. Being nah, I ain't say small. I still want bigger boobs. Like I still want big boobs, just not as big. Cause these do make my back hurt. Like sitting down. Like even when I was at work in San Antonio, like I kept having to like crack my back and stuff. Cause my back was just hurting, like bad. So breast reduction and three sixty. I don't want no more. But cause once they take. Once I feel like once they take this part from my um from there, 
everybody's going to be able to see my butt a lot more. Like, I'm able to see it. I've always been wide and thick, but in the right places, period. Don't get that confused, boo. Always thick in the right places. Boo, yeah. Anyways, so that's going to conclude this video. That's how I look. I didn't want to get all the way undressed because YouTube purposes. But um, so try on hauls, all this, my business stuff, ways to grow your channel is also coming out really, really, really soon. All of that's going to be coming out this week because I have to make it up to y'all because I know, I know. I haven't did videos, but I have real reasons and life really hit down here. So, thank y'all for tuning in. Thank y'all for watching. We're going nowhere, but what? Uh, that's on period. That's all day. Check out my girl, Gaisha TV. Check out my other girl's, I think her channel name is Sav, Savvy Blogs. We all went to school together. We were always in a band together. We all know each other. Check us out. We going up together, and that's on period. Deuces. Deuces. Eh.